And now, your first alert Storm Center forecast. Thank you for joining us on this Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to my mom also watching in New Jersey. If you have plans for the evening, maybe you're barbecuing outside. Temperatures upper 70s right now, dropping down into the lower and middle 70s over the next couple hours. And then by 11 o'clock tonight, 65 degrees, partly cloudy skies out there. So a very nice evening for your plans. All is quiet on our live pinpoint Doppler radar. Plenty of sunshine out there for the day and right now for the evening as well. That's because area of high pressure parked over north central West Virginia, bringing us plenty of sunshine, light winds, and much warmer temperatures behind this cold front, or warm front rather, that passed through last night. Temperatures today got into the upper 70s to around 80 degrees. Here's our highs today. 78 was the high in Clarksburg, 79 up in Morgantown. Got to 80 in Grafton, also in Weston, and lower 80s in Sutton, Glenville, Harrisville, and West Union. Right now outside, still pretty warm out there. Still sitting at 78 in Clarksburg, 79 in Weston, and 80 in Glenville and Sutton. Now, temperatures later this week will be near 90 degrees. I'll let you know which days those near 90 degree temperatures will occur coming up in your first alert forecast. And now, your first alert storm center forecast. Thank you for tuning in to 5 News at 6 on this Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day again to all you moms watching out there. Hope you got the chance to enjoy the nice day because got in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees with plenty of sunshine. It doesn't get much better than that. For tonight, pretty mild overnight, only down to 57. And we'll see partly cloudy skies and dry through the evening. Could be an isolated thunderstorm overnight for tonight, but most of us will stay dry during the overnight hours. But if you hear a rumble of thunder while you're sleeping at night, just be aware that it is in the forecast. Many of us, though, won't see it. We'll drop down into the lower 50s in the mountains east of I-79. Uh, pretty much upper 50s to around 60 degrees for the rest of north central West Virginia. 57 for Clarksburg, 60 for Glenville. Take a look at your weather headlines now. It's going to be very warm to start the new work and school week on Monday and Tuesday. Temperatures making a run at 90 degrees, also making a run at record high temperatures. I'll show you uh, those temperatures coming up. Turning unsettled though by the middle of the week as a cold front makes a run at our region. And by the weekend, well, we will be turning cooler temperatures go back into the 60s, so uh, behind the unsettled weather becomes uh, cooler as well. All is quiet on our live pinpoint Doppler radar, and it will re remain quiet through at least the evening hours. Outside right now, pretty warm out there, 79 in Elkins, 78 in Clarksburg, 80 degrees out in Parkersburg, 82 down in Charleston at the 6 o'clock hour. For the day on Monday, very warm, 87 degrees. Some places... We'll make a run at 90 degrees, very warm and humid, so feeling like summer. Some thunderstorms will pop up during the afternoon from the heating of the day, so take the umbrella with you when you're heading out the door in the morning. We'll get into the upper 80s, near 90 degrees in Glenville, Harrisville, and West Union. 86 for Grafton, and we'll get into the mid-80s in the mountains for your Monday afternoon. Now here's a look at the record highs for Monday, calling for 87 in Clarksburg. We'll come up short of the record of 92. Also come up short in Elkins, Morgantown, and Parkersburg. But Wheeling, record down there is 81 for tomorrow. We're forecasting 85, so a new record high will probably be set in Wheeling on Monday. For Tuesday, our record in Clarksburg is 89. We're forecasting that, so we probably will tie our record high here in Clarksburg on Tuesday. Elkins, Morgantown, Parkersburg will come up short again, but Wheeling, again, will break their record high if they get to 86 because their record is 83 degrees. Now here's the seven-day forecast. Unsettled for uh, Monday and Tuesday with pop-up thunderstorms during the afternoon, but more unsettled by Wednesday as a cold front makes a run at our region. Temperatures only around 80 degrees with those scattered thunderstorms. More widespread showers and storms in the forecast for Thursday behind the cold front, and it does turn cooler, 70 degrees. Even cooler for Friday, mid-60s with a few showers around. The Strawberry Festival down in Buckhannon on Saturday, we have spotty showers in the forecast, but we'll monitor it for you all week long. Forecast always online at WDTV.com. Still cool for the weekend. Temperatures in the low 60s both days with a little bit more in the way of sunshine on Sunday. And now, your first alert storm center forecast. Welcome back to 5 News at 6. We'll help you plan your evening and overnight hours. By 8 o'clock, we'll be down into the lower 70s, so a very nice evening. Overnight tonight, though, there could be an isolated shower in one or two spots between 2 and 5 in the morning, we'll call it, but most of us will stay dry. And we'll bottom out only in the upper 50s. And when you're waking up tomorrow morning for your morning commute, temperatures near 60 degrees with a mixture of sunshine and clouds. Now, with this uh, warm weather, that means the pollen has been on, on the high side, but it will lower a bit for tomorrow down to the, the moderate levels. Then it jumps back up to high for Tuesday, and then as sh showers and thunderstorms move in on Wednesday, that will lower our pollen levels down close to the low level. So some relief for allergy sufferers will come by the middle of the week. Stick around. We'll have one final look at your seven-day forecast coming up. 
All right, Brian, so let's talk a little bit about our weather. What do we have in our forecast coming up? Well, we're going to feel like summer for the first couple of days of the week. Temperatures the next couple of days are going to be near 90 degrees, so we're going to make a run at record highs. We'll take a look at your seven-day forecast. Upper 80s for Monday, we'll call it, but some places make a run at 90. Spotty thunderstorms will pop up during the afternoon from the heat of the day. Similar story for Tuesday, except a couple of degrees warmer. Some places may reach or exceed 90 on Tuesday. We'll call it 89 for Clarksburg with, again, those pop-up thunderstorms during the afternoon. Then as a cold front approaches on Wednesday, we'll see scattered thunderstorms out ahead of that and then more showers and storms for Thursday and a bit cooler behind the front down to about 70. Then the cooler air continues to work in for the rest of the seven day forecast. Temperatures down in the mid 60s for Friday with a few showers around. Then for the start of the Strawberry Festival on Saturday, cool temperatures in the low 60s with spotty showers. And we dry out a little bit for Sunday, still only in the low 60s though, and some more in the way of sunshine by then as well, but still that isolated shower chance is still in the forecast through next weekend. Perfect. Well, thank you very much. And I know we gave a shout out to our moms at the beginning of the show, but apparently our stream wasn't working. So I would like to take the opportunity to say Happy Mother's Day to my beautiful mother who's watching in Maryland. Happy Mother's Day to my mother who's watching in New Jersey tonight. So hopefully that worked this time. Hopefully they got it. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. But and I hope you guys have a wonderful Mother's Day. We'll be back here at 5 News at 11. Have a great evening.